The Port of San Diego is about people. People that come and visit us, people that earn their livelihood around the port, whether you're a maritime worker, you're a longshoreman, you work in a hotel, you own one of our restaurants. It's people that really make the port special. And it's really the people that have suffered greatly in the last couple of years during this uncertain time of COVID. When COVID hit, I think, first of all, there was an uncertainty, how long will this pandemic last? And also the loss of lives. Everybody has somebody that they know that directly was affected, whether it was from health or, or uh, even from a career standpoint. We started hearing news and, you know, about this pandemic. And shortly thereafter, um, a council member, a very beloved council member for Chula Vista, got sick and was put into the hospital and actually ended up being on a ventilator. And that really hit home. When you start this job, you always think, if everything really went bad, you know, do you still show up to work? And the reality is, yep, we still showed up to work. The freeways were empty when we drove to work. We still responded and didn't miss one step. It was, to be frank, a little haunting, odd, scary. Like, we're, there's nobody here. We're used to lots of people here on the waterfront. We still had to maintain the, our restaurants. Our restaurants remained open, and you know, we, we had water leaks, uh, sewer stoppages, so we had to be here. We have a lot of hospitality tenants on the waterfront when they closed the restaurants and all the hospitality industry. Those businesses were concerned about how, how do I stay in business? The thing I was able to do is be a good listener and then work with the port to say, hey, we have tenants here that are really concerned about going out of business. I'm proud to say not one of our businesses on the Port Thailands went out of business. And that was because of this partnership that we've had. During the pandemic, the port community really did come together. We didn't lay people off. We weren't evicting people. We came together and we said, we're gonna do whatever it takes to make sure that we're not losing businesses and we're not losing jobs. Being able to go to work, have someone to report to, um, have a job was, was a blessing during the pandemic. There's tremendous hope. I mean, one thing this pandemic has done, it's put us in some uncomfortable positions, had us find solutions, different processes and procedures to doing things. And, and, and some of those have put us in a position to do things better in the future. Usually the operation is running at full pace 24 seven, and you don't really get that time to slow down. Um, so the pandemic, it gave us a time to breathe and relook at our operation, assess what could be done better. And my shop got an entire revamp. It was really amazing that with all the disruption and working from home and adjusting to that, they were able to really still come through and really achieve a lot that year. I hope that our relationship with the port continues to be strengthened. If we can have one, one voice together, and I think we learned that through the pandemic, I am hopeful that we can move the knob and have even a better economy. In the future, when we face challenges, folks are gonna be better prepared to face those challenges. They've seen the big bad wolf. They've seen this once in a generational thing and they know that, oh my God, we have stared down the dragon, if you will, and we can overcome this thing. The things that I've seen people do and the district bouncing back, that's all proves that, that we're going to get through this together and even stronger than we were before. The people here are brilliant. They're tenacious, they're diligent, they care. They care about their work, they care about the port, they care about the people that come and visit here, they are just amazingly talented, creative people. I see the dedication of the people that work at the Port of San Diego. I could not be more proud, I could not be more happy um, to be associated with an organization like the Port with the awesome, awesome people that we have working here. I'm excited about the legacy and the mark that we can make on our region, and I know we're gonna do some great things.